Hey guys, welcome back to another Destiny 2 video. It is Tuesday, so it is reset January 29th, 2019. It's also Last Word Day, so happy Last Word Day to y'all. And uh, today we're just going to be going over the Ascendant Challenge, uh, where it's located, and then do a quick little solo guide. So if you're still trying to level up, completing these Dreaming City activities are probably some of the best to get uh, some really good loot out of them uh, if you're still trying to hit uh, 650. I'm, I'm still trying to, so that's why I do them every single week. And I like doing these challenges, uh, they're a lot of fun. So let's get into it guys, we'll just jump into the Dreaming City here. Alright, so once we get into the Dreaming City, just uh, path over this way, just follow where I go um, to Petra and just make sure you pick up all your bounties from her. I did speed this up a little bit, so hopefully you can follow it. It's not not too fast, and you should be pretty familiar with where to go. She's all chick monked out. All right, once you get all your bounties, just just continue this way. We're gonna go to like where the cathedral there uh, in the distance is at. That's where the uh, taken um, challenge is gonna be at the portal there to, that we have to jump through. And so I usually just take that way. If you have another way, go ahead and do that. And then jump on my sparrow and just continue on. Yeah, it's the same thing as the mission that's this week as well. You have to go through the monastery and um, clear it out, kill, kill the boss at the end. So it's the same, same path if you've already done that. And then once you get here, just make sure you take your tincture um, so you can get Ascendant. Um, yeah, take that red pill with the tincture, and then right over here to the right of the bridge there, you'll see these um, platforms show up when you're Ascendant. Just jump on those, and then boom, right through into the Ascendant Challenge. So once we're in here, um, there is a bounty to find Tolan this, uh, today. Uh, Petra does have that bounty, so make sure you pick that up. And when you are in here, we'll find Tolan. He's in a pretty easy spot to locate. Um, so we'll just path this way, and then ultimately, right in that gazebo is where the fight's going to go on. And we'll just continue. Alright, so Tolan's down there. You can see him down in the bottom left of the screen there. Um, and you can actually jump down to him. I did find it. one of my previous videos I just died because I couldn't find a way to get back up um, but if you jump down here get to long we'll complete that bounty Eris, my dear Eris, if only you could see us here if only you had not turned away toward your selfish business. all right so we got the bounty done and then what you can do yeah is just jump up to that little ledge there and then jump over here to this one and yeah, you can jump back up. Um, yeah, and then we'll get to the actual fight. So what you want to do here is actually clear out all the enemies. Once you shoot one of these wizards or the witches, wizards, um, it's going to start the activity. And what you need to do is um, clear all the ads out here, and then a sword's going to spawn in the middle. And then once you pick up that sword, uh, one of the knights is going to uh, attack you. And the knight's always going to be the uh, champion of Zol, I think is, is what the knight is, we'll see here. Yeah, so there's the sword. Um, so once you pick up that sword, yeah, right there, this guy, the spurned of Zol or whatever the heck, spurned by Zol. Uh, that guy's going to always be the knight that spawns first. So once you get him low or, or kill him, then the other two will become active. And you just want to do the um, the slam attack with the sword, and you'll you'll kill him pretty quick. Just run around, try not to get bopped off by the uh, phalanx, the taken phalanx, and then um, yeah, just just keep slamming these guys. It's going to stagger them, so they won't be able to hit you. And just be careful with all the other adds. Um, but once you do kill both of them, um, everything will despawn. Just like there, I got lucky. Almost died. And then you'll just get to this little orb there, and it'll uh, Tolan or whatever you want to call him. Tolan will show you the way, his light will show you the way of where to go. And you want to make sure you have the sword with you and take it all the way to the end on this challenge. 
And be careful for those too, because they will kill you. Good thing that phalanx popped me up there and over them. But uh, yeah, just kill all the enemies here that are in your way, and just just jump uh, through this part, watching out for these uh, other platforms that spawn in here. It ain't, it ain't too bad. And this one's this one's uh, not too bad at all once you get comfortable with it. Yeah, I'll just jump through here, and that's gonna be the end over here. And then once we get here with the sword. Uh, the chest will spawn and we'll be able to get our loot. And then that challenge is complete. The Ascendant challenge is done. And you just walk up over here on these steps and jump through the portal to get out of here. There we go. Oh, and I got a, a, a emblem. Nice. All right, guys. So that's going to do it for this video this week. Uh, it is the Ascendant challenge location and solo guide for January 29th, 2019. Um, you know, I really hope that this helped you out. And if it did help you out, please leave a like and uh, a comment. And go ahead and share the video as well. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe. Um, and leave a comment below if there's something you want to see different or maybe something else you want to see. Uh, just let me know. I really appreciate you guys being here and taking your time out of your day to watch the video. It means a lot. So thanks for that support. And I hope you all are having a great day wherever you're at. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.